Hey cuties, welcome back to my channel. I am Cute Little Voice. Today I'm coming in with another wig analysis on this gorgeous uni right here. I am simply in love. This one gives me uh, butterflies. <laughs> I love this one, ladies. Um, it does have one con, but we're going to get into that in one second. If you're new to my channel, make sure you please subscribe down below. I do hair reviews, hauls, and anything fashion here on my channel. So let's get into it. Um, this is from Fratress Equal, part of the Luxury Integration line. Uh, premium HD braided lace front wig in the style net NAT box braid 20, uh, 28 inches and I have it in a color copper. So this is a solid copper color. So as you can see on the model, uh, she has the same unit I have on and her skin complexion just looks so good with this um, copper color. So I did have to pick it up. Now, before we get started, uh, I did want to show, tell you that I will have uh, styling options at the end and we'll get into what the back of the wig looks like and everything like that. Different hairstyles and I add, I'll add some um, jewelry onto the unit. Um, so let's get into that one kind that mostly all braiding units have when you're getting it from like Fridge is Equal, Sensational, Outre, um, Bobby Boss, and all of those type of companies. Um, you're going to get like, you know, like it's going to be on a mesh cap or it's going to have spaces and everything like that. But that's only to prevent bulkiness. Um, when you put too much hair on a cap, it's just gonna be too heavy and too bulky. So yeah, um, pretty much when I wear it down and I swing my hair, if you were to wear it down, it's definitely going to conceal because of how this uh, unit is constructed. It's braided a little bit like downward to the middle. So um, it's braided flat midway so that it will not show any of those um, open spaces. Okay, so let's get into this unit. It did come with an HD lace, which is really meltable and it looks seamless. It looks really good. Now, I did add my pressed powder here into the part. And I know somebody asked before what pressed powder I use. So I'm going to go ahead and tell you, you guys, um, I use the mineralized skin finish powder uh, by MAC in the color Deep. So, um, yeah, that's what I use. And um, I just put a little bit here and then a little bit in the parts here. Now, um, what you want to do if you, if you have black hair, uh, you want to just gel that up so your sides are not showing. So that black isn't peeking through. So, yeah, that's something that you can do. Use some edge control or some gel. Got to be glue, whatever you can use to kind of um gel that back so it won't be you know so noticeable with the black um so yeah it does come with a i think this is a four by four uh let's see if it says i know it it looks wider than a four by four so i'm gonna say uh a five a five by four so uh five across five inches across and four back all in this area so um i'll get into that at the end of the video like i said um so let's list some of the colors you get your 1b uh one two six thirteen um copper which is this color and then you get your mixed colors 27 6 13 and uh 4 30 so let me show you the colors right quick this color here which i really want to go back and get this is the cb uh 27 6 13 this is all uh, uh platinum blonde which is the 6 13 this is the 4 30 with um blended 30 in there and then you have the 1b so super cute colors if you do want to venture out and try something other than a color that i have okay so um this one is yes it's 20 28 inches in length so it goes past my you know my breast so right at my waist at the top of my waist is coming down the braids are constructed very very nicely it's sealed down to the bottom um it twists at the bottom here so it's like sealed really good um so i'm assuming they use some like glue at the end of here to kind of seal it well um, now the density of this uh, unit 
uh, I would say it's about a medium to full density. Um, so it's not too many braids, but it's not skimpy. I think it's just enough. Okay, so I'm going to give you a 360. Okay, so um, what else can I say? The luster is pretty good on it. The baby hairs came pretty sparse. Um, and it's just a really, really good unit. As far as the cap size, it is big head friendly. Um, so you can, you know, fit into this cap. If you have a smaller head like I do, you may want to crisscross the lashes. Um, now, you do get two combs uh, at the front, at the temples. Um, on each side, metal combs, as well as an adjustable strap, and as well as a elastic band, which is really good because it's really thick and it is adjustable, so you can tighten it and loosen it to your comfort. So yeah, um, I'm trying to see if I'm leaving anything else out about this unit. Uh, of course, it's not going to tangle, it's not shedding, and pretty much run your hands through this one. I like that this here, you can flip this over from right to left and you don't have to worry about any gappage or anything like, you know, the cap showing. So they do have it kind of braided down on each side so you can give yourself a left side part or a right side part, which I like. So I flipped it to the right. So I like it like that. And so I'm gonna go ahead and get into the styling. Um, I'm gonna go check on my baby first cause you probably can hear him in the video. And I'll be right back, see you soon.